Oh, Walter, I got a notice that said you triggered a firewall. Can you tell me about what happened? I was just trying to find a stuffed animal for my granddaughter. I typed in stuffed beavers. Oh, yeah, that explains it, I'm afraid. I think we've been ghosted by our second shift supervisor. He texted me and said he hadn't had an accident in his pants and that he had to go home and change. But he never came back and he won't answer my calls. You mean he shit his pants? Oh, I wouldn't return after that either. Emergency? Uh, is that, is that blood? I am sorry, but you are not allowed to use our tools and our parts to service our customers on off the book repairs using our van while we pay you to be on call and your direct reports know you do this? Ever face something that you know you have to do? In fact, you may have even volunteered to do, yet you put it off and maybe you take a whack at it, but then you allow yourself to get distracted. Could be your taxes or a very detailed and research heavy report. Well, since it must be done, here's how to do it. You gotta love it. You heard me right. Tell yourself you love doing it, that it's a miracle that you get to do it. It's a treat to be filling out page after page of tedious forms. You relish the feeling of jumping in and getting it done. You can even paste a fake smile on your face. Science has shown that the mere act of smiling can lift your mood, lower stress, boost your immune system, and possibly even prolong your life. Dr. Isha Gupta, a neurologist, explains a smile spurs a chemical reaction in the brain releasing certain hormones, including dopamine and serotonin, which can increase happiness and reduce stress. Smiling can trick your brain into believing you're happy, which can then spur actual feelings of happiness. Dr. Murray Grossman, an ENT specialist in LA, points to the science of psychoneuroimmunology, the study of how the brain is connected to the immune system. He asserts that it has been shown over and over again that depression weakens your immune system, while happiness, on the other hand, has been shown to boost our body's resistance to disease. Researchers at the University of Kansas published findings that smiling helps reduce the body's response to stress and lowers heart rate in tense situations. Another study linked smiling to lower blood pressure, while yet another suggests that smiling leads to longevity. And the wise folks say that much of our suffering comes from resistance. So when we resist some task, aren't we just creating suffering? So if we stop ourselves from sending angry, exhausted thoughts about that wretched task, and you can say something else like, getting this done will help my coworker, so I'm gonna do a great job. So turn your attitude around, paste a grin on your face, and get through it. You might find yourself truly enjoying the work. Cheers. Please like, follow, comment, share, all that good stuff.